I remember when I was younger, I would go to Chinatown with my parents and they had a friend who was a tea merchant. They would go there and he would make tea and chat with them. And it stuck in my mind because he would make tea out of these really small pots and cups. It wasn't until I was older that I realized he was doing the Gong Fu Cha ceremony. Each stage of the process has the traditional name. From the first stage, it translates to warming the pot and heating the cups. The second stage is filling of the pots with the fresh leaves and appreciating the aroma of the tea leaves. The leaves customarily go through a slightly extended washing process where hot water is poured from high above the pot. They are then left to rest briefly so the temperature in the outside of the pot equalizes. The first brew is poured into cups but not drunk. The pot is refilled with fresh hot water until the water reaches the mouth of the pot. After it is steeped, it is poured into the teacups in a circular motion for an even distribution. Both quality oolong teas and pu'ers can be steeped more than half a dozen times. Tea is such an important part of our Chinese culture. We drink it every day, offer it to every guest that comes into the home. When I got married, we had a traditional tea ceremony to pay respect to our parents and elders. We would kneel and offer them tea in exchange for their well wishes and gifts. My appreciation for tea and all its tradition grows more and more with every cup.